I have just given Mary a voice bio to get a voice print to obtain a musical plan for her current frequency needs. And we've talked through the physical aspects and the emotional aspects of all those things. We talked through her S sine curve and why I want to build up certain frequencies in her musical plan that are specific for her. And uh, it was very much revealed the why of those frequencies being depleted. So I'm gonna do it through a musical piece, but I've also suggested targeting some specific colors some specific gems. And I love what Lindy Strong always says, um, scripture is full of gems. And we always take gems as being kind of new age and not for the body. However, because scripture is full of gems, they're beautiful. He created them. And if we want, uh, he directs us to use gems in our healing journeys. All we have to do is plug it into the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus sanctifies and purifies everything. Holy Spirit will take care of doing what needs to be done so we can use that. And then there were some very, there was a very long list for each of the four frequencies that we talked about in Mary's musical plan. And um, we narrowed it down by the ones that repeat and crossed over two and three frequencies because oils and those things are very expensive. We have to use them with carrier oils, certain ways to use them. So we limit the list so that they can target what we're cooking with, what we're putting in our body, on our body. Um, we target them and narrowed it down to about four that crossed over all those frequencies. And by using those four, it will enhance this musical plan. And just like when she goes to the chiropractor and that adjustment isn't holding anymore, she'll know when this musical plan and those things have done what we met together today for them to do. And it's time for a recheck kind of thing. So I've read a scripture over her. I've prayed over her. I've surrendered everything that we're doing with the keyboards, the tunings, the settings, all of it to the Holy Spirit's leading as well as the scripture, I printed it out and I will interject it into the one key that I'm gonna play the longest over her in. And it doesn't sound like American music. It sounds a little unique because it's come from the Hebrew, which is all uh, pictorial, three-dimensional. It's way more dimensional than our English language than what we work with. So we like to incorporate that piece into her plan as well. So with all of that being said, is there anything you want to add based on what we did or something I missed as I was giving that little introduction? Uh, you actually covered it quite well. And, okay. <clears throat> you know, I, it, it is, it's amazing how things did cross over and the spices that I'm going to be adding to my diet and the colors and the flowers and the oils. So I love it. I love it. I love how right. God works through you. Great. So on that note, I will just turn it over to the Holy Spirit. I will play over you for as long as he wants to play. And we'll keep in mind that this is being recorded and it's shorter. And then I will send Mary the MP3 when we're all three, all done. So with that, I will begin.
Thank you. And at this time, I would let the client just sit there and bask in what the Lord did. I usually go on for a little longer, but because of the recording, I just condensed it a little bit. Um, I would oftentimes have the client just lay down, have your journal. If you're willing to share anything, sometimes we like to just keep those things very personal and precious. So at this juncture, I'll turn it back over to you. Thank you. That was awesome. <laughs> I'm like <laughs> very blessed. I felt like my cells were dancing to that music. And it was reaffirming some of the things that the Lord has spoken to my heart about the anointing to help heal the wounded people and you know, give them beauty instead of ashes and such. So I really appreciated the Holy Spirit gave you that that word because um, sometimes in life when things don't go the way we had hoped they did as soon as we hoped that they would, um, I began kind of questioning, oh, should I be going this way? But I felt in my spirit, yes, I need to focus on like the healing campus. Um, and so that was just really validating definitely validating and um, I look forward to getting the mp3 to bring those levels up that were low and the ones that were too high down um, obviously I can't share a lot of the process that Tammy brought me through because of like she said copyrighted situations but I highly encourage our audience to book an appointment with her because this is profound. I've not experienced somebody incorporating it all together. And so um, thank you, Tammy. I mean, what an honor to be able to- I'm just an honor to have been able to be able to, to do this today. So yeah. thank you. Yeah, I mean, it was def definitely experiential. And so I just, again, I encourage the audience to experience this. Um, the sound might be different as, as Tammy was sharing, the Zoom filters certain things out. So um, the MP3, I look forward to getting to even hear more that Zoom may be filtered out. And yes. so know this, that book an appointment with her and get your own MP3. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. And I should say also, I included strings in yours because strings have the capacity to balance odd and even harmonics the best. Oh. And we're looking for balance. We're looking for wholeness in all this. So I incorporated that into the key that I played over the most in right. you and for you, as well as the scripture that I translated into the music. Right. Yeah. And that's a whole. Could you explain the scripture part? Because you did bring it up a bit. But sure. that that the um, the I, I don't know the I don't know the terms that you use to explain that, but it's profound. I have software that's called Music from God. You can get it anywhere, and what it does is it takes the Hebrew and it converts it to treble clef notation that you can print it out. So I got this scripture, and then I just printed out. The verses, some of them are shorter. You have to be careful because every letter has so many notes. So you're going to end up with this whole big long thing with just like two verses. Wow. So I did, three, I did three verses for you and ended up with two pages. Wow. And what, I, what it's my job as the musician, there's no key signature on this. There's no harmony, no chords, no rhythms, no time signatures. It's all just out. And I leave it that way because then the Holy Spirit is allowed, uh, I give him the freedom to show me where does the melody fit in? How does it work? What chords do you want to put it in? How does the progression flow? And I'm listening to him the whole time. So when I inserted that, mm -hmm. that's what I was doing. So that's in your in the in the middle piece, which is in the key of E. Wow. I mean, that that's profound uh, to have, be able to to do that. I mean what what has been created up until this point that blesses us with the words 
in, in us at a cellular level. Cause that's how I was feeling like that word, my cells mm. were dancing. I was receiving yes. that word at a cellular level and it's hard Amen. to explain, but you know, for me, it's just, I can feel it at a cellular level. So, and spirit Amen. level, obviously. <laughs> yes, for sure. Well, I love that piece of it because uh, the whole word is is so much more than just speaking it in this English language it it does get down to the cellular level and when you add the music frequencies into that and I love the fact that he says when he speaks a word and that bore witness to you so mm -hmm. I love that it confirmed it does not return void it accomplishes what he sends it to do and I stand in faith on that every time for every client so yes ah, wonderful I'm thankful that ministered to you <laughs> Well, I'm excited again, uh, book an appointment with Tammy and at soundexpression.net and explore her whole website. There's a lot of, a lot of information there that is just a blessing. It was a blessing to me. And I was, I was happy, Tammy, that you answered my email. <laughs> Please, I want to interview you. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and I gotta say, Tammy was going through a move at the time also. So it's like, oh, I'm honored that you said yes. So thank you. <laughs> I had to chuckle when you said I have all this energy because I've moved <laughs> twice in the last three months. And so uh, everything into storage and then everything out of storage. So <laughs> and he promised me he'd give me the strength to do it because he was asking me to do that. And yeah. he did what he said. So thank you. <laughs> That's great. Well, um, thank you so much for for this whole experience and, and for your gifting from and your obedience. To